Welcome back, beer tubers. Ryan here, back with another episode of San Diego Beer Vlog. Can't believe it's already that time, but the pumpkin ales are out. Last year, I wanted to review this one. I waited too long, and when I went to review it, it wasn't very fresh. So we're going to take a look at it fresh this year. This is Shipyard's Smash Pumpkin Ale. It's a big 9% Imperial Pumpkin Ale. I remember a lot of people liking it last year, so I wanted to make sure I got a bottle fresh this year to review, even though I really don't feel like drinking pumpkin ales yet because it's still very warm out. So let's get this one poured. I've had this a couple times, it's had the last couple years. Pours out very clear, it's definitely got to be filtered. Uh, nice dark golden color into light orange. You get about three quarters of a slightly off-white head. Uh, good amount of carbonation coming up. Let's get the aroma. Yeah, it's got a lot going on. You, you pick up the actual pumpkin character, you pick up the pumpkin spices, and you pick up a nice breadiness as well. That malt character comes through. I'd say the nutmeg's standing out to me the most. You get a little cinnamon underneath that. You know, a little bit of that allspice character in there. Just that your typical pumpkin spices are certainly present on the nose. And 9% that head's pretty much gone. There are some alcohol legs on here. You know, it smells really nice, so let's dig in. Cheers. That's a really nicely done pumpkin ale. Up front, I wasn't getting a ton of flavor, but wow. Mid palate just really turns on the flavor and it finishes really nice. I, I, this beer is really balanced between the malt character, the spice character, and the pumpkin character. It's, it's impressive so far. I'm gonna drink it on a bit more though. So up front on this beer, I actually get some bitterness. And they talk about using Willamette and Hallertow hops to kind of help balance out the beer. At 9%, it's definitely not overly sweet, at least not at the cooler temperatures, so that's nice. But definitely front of the tongue, bitterness, uh, earthy bitterness that works really well. A uh, little bit of like a grassy note too, but mostly just this kind of really earthy, woody kind of character up front. And then it transitions into big sweetness big sweet bread, light bit of caramel malt, or at least caramel kind of flavor coming through, like almost a brown sugar character. And then midway th through the palate, it, the spices really kick in. You're getting the allspice, the cinnamon, the nutmeg, and that kind of helps that sweetness kind of back off a bit. And then as it finishes towards the end, the actual pumpkin flavor comes through which is uh, really nice. It's not just a pumpkin spice character. It's actually got you know real pumpkin flavor in there. And as that pumpkin character fades, the beer dries out really nicely. The sweetness takes a back seat to the actual pumpkin flavor and the alcohol kind of comes forward. It's not super boozy. Uh, you kind of feel the alcohol. You, don't, you taste just, just a tiny bit. It's pretty well masked. I mean, there's a lot going on. Uh, this is a really, really well done pumpkin ale. I recommend getting it fresh while you can taste all those really intense pumpkin characteristics to it. It's, it's got the nice bready crustiness that you get from the pumpkin pie, the actual pumpkin, some sweetness, you know, some kind of sugary notes in there. It, it's, it's what you want from a pumpkin ale. Don't know if it quite tops pumpkin for me because it kind of lacks that, that creamy, sort of vanilla character that Pumpkin has, but this is uh, this is right there up there with it. I'm gonna go with an A. Recommended if you wanna check out a great pumpkin ale, at least one that's available, you know, probably most parts of the country. I mean, this is the East Coast beer from Maine that we actually get out here from Shipyard. So that's gonna wrap up this review. Definitely check this one out. Until next time, please comment, subscribe. Cheers.